prosecutors originally planned. A new development today in a triple murder case from 1997. The convicted murderer is on death row, but as Jeff Allen shows us, family on both sides hope new DNA evidence will finally answer questions they've had for years. We just want answers. We just want to know what happened. We want to know who's responsible for stripping us of our childhood. At only four, Brandy Ferrier lost her mother, Willa Jean Ferrier. Ferrier, Crystal Knatzer, and Chris Boswell were all murdered in McCreary County in March of 1997. John Garland is on death row for those murders. But Garland's family says evidence found at the scene has never been tested. Evidence they believe could clear the now 69-year-old. My brother, he's very sick in health and all, and he really needs help, you know, and we need to find out and prove that he's innocent. Up until now, McCreary County Circuit Court has blocked new DNA testing, but after the Kentucky Supreme Court overruled that, today the lower court agreed to let state police go ahead and test several samples of human hair from the scene. Willa Jean Ferrier's family, who also have ties to Garland, say if he's not the killer, they want to know who is. March will be 15 years. You know, and that's a long time to have to, you know, to go every day without without answers of, you know, why things happened the way they did. Crystal Knatzer's sister. I miss her every day. Doesn't think the new evidence will point to a different killer. I just want to put it behind us and move on. Covering the news in McCreary County, Jeff Allen, LEX 18 News.